uh, I stayed at the diplomat for, for two weeks. In quarantine, it's been tough. I'm not used to staying in a hotel room, can't go out, but uh, they've been very nice and accommodating. So at least good gym at night when they're closed, so at least kept me busy a while. Uh, I talk to Ben Franks a lot with the scrumming wise, and uh, I've seen him a couple of times. Obvious COVID regulated, and uh, I thought the, the conditioning coaches have been talking to me, and the gym coaches, and it's everything's been perfect. Couldn't ask for better. Yeah. It's very, very nice to be here. Met a couple of guys, uh, second day of training. And uh, everyone's, it's, it's very nice to be here. Everyone's very friendly. Yes, it's, 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 I think uh, somewhere 14th of March was my last game. So I've been out a long time with, with the quarantine and then of uh, my previous team being liquidated. So, yes. Yeah, when, when we, we got liquidated, I had a couple of, of uh, teams that said they, was in, they were interested. But uh, they took long and it was a big thing with the COVID, it, you know, everyone was uncertain will there be rugby even this year in South Africa and then uh, I got the opportunity to, to come to the Scarlets and, and I grabbed it immediately, it was a, it was a no-brainer. Well, that was that quite difficult because uh, it's winter here then it's summer there and, so, and, and it's a whole different type of rugby, it's, it's a harder rugby, a bit slower and South African rugby is a bit quicker but not as as a lot of set phases, can I say? When I was a little small kid, I used to watch his. They, they, when they won the World Cup, they had to do TV shows, all of the All Blacks. So uh, um, I watched his TV show and bought his book, him and his brother's gym book. And so I'm a big fan of him. So very, he's a very nice guy.